Let the pain commence. We are back, baby. It's peanut butter jelly time. Lance is not has returned. This time he's Mangus Lance is not. And he also looks like Gollum. Anyway, in this brand new adventure or punishment, we'll be testing and using the Batanian mounted skirmishes. Thank you to those who suggested these units. Although I reckon you did it because you wanted to see me struggle. These units are pointless. The reason why they're pointless, everyone, is because they're classed as horse archers and yet they don't have any bow and arrows, but javelins normally that'd be fine except there's one problem they only have five after that they're just regular cavalry so random and pointless so well, anyway let's just get the volunteers in as these will lead into the mounted skirmishes we'll probably throw their few sticks and get no kills then turn to normal cavalry so let's get them in after we get all our men in except for one which will keep us a healer we need to address our funding because we'll need it for the horses so we all know what's coming let's all say it it's tournament time Time. Don't forget to bet on yourself. Easy money. Told you, easy money. So we win more tournaments and sell all that reward. I love winning horses. We're looking good, but we can get better. Let's get a caravan. Who do we go for though for the trade? Before you all say anything, yes, I know it looks like I'm boring, but I did actually want the exile, but she's not in the game again, so I'm sorry. Again, this is the reason why though. Go and make me money, because my goodness, I need it. Now that's sword, let's get the healer in. Who do we choose? Decisions, decisions. Oh, I love the scholar. And that's why, baby. Now we're ready to slap up some bandits. Speak of the devil. And let's send you to him. No casualties. What'd I just say? Oh, you're lucky. You get a second chance. You're next. Don't let me down here now. Good. That's better. As we slap up more looters, we see what I didn't want to see. I need war mounts. Yay. Ugh. That's just for six horses, man. There you go, you greedy gets. Now all the greedy gets have got their horses. Our army is ready, but we are not. And thanks to all those horses we have to buy, we've got no money. So we know what that means. We need to get money. It's tournament time. And by winning many more tournaments, we sell those rewards. I love those horses. Like I said, time to splash the cash. Time to get him really shiny. He looks amazing, but I want to cry. We are now clan tier level one. Thanks to his tournaments, we all know what's coming. One, we become a mercenary, but up more importantly, more. Hello again, King Pincer. I want to join your stick and corrupt faction as a mercenary. Look how angry he looks. We don't care. And we are obviously at war with someone. And there's actually a bit, a bit of casualties. Let's add to it. You're my first victim. Let's see how the skirmishes get on here. That's a good start. So we slam up people with the skirmishes and we end up running into the emperor. That lovely helmet ain't gonna help you. I might be biting off more I can chew, but let's see. But we're gonna put them to the sword and the sword was victorious. Look at that, they did really well. Only lost two. While we were preparing for a siege, we got attacked by a big army. They have the more men so this will be a challenge let's go how many horses okay this is going down to the wire ow well we still win barely oh that's terrible you ain't taking any castle oh i really hope they have a better performance here we won to no surprise and yet again underwhelming they don't learn do they now someone else is attacking this castle oh i'm just chilling and letting the army just do their thing victory is ours Yet again, completely underwhelming. But we are now clan to level 2, which is nice. But we all know what's coming there, don't we? First, we become an actual vassal. But more importantly, more! So we need to speak to King Pinter again, who looks like he wants to slit my throat in about four different ways. But we're going to become a vassal anyway. What better way to prove to be a valuable vassal than a siege? That army can stay bloody there as well. Get those ladders up, baby! Oh my, can those crossbowmen just give it a rest? Quick siege, crap again. Wow, I didn't get one vote for the castle, even though I just joined, I've got nothing. Screw these guys. Now let's take out that army that was next to me before. You should have took us out when you had the chance. I guess that's what I deserve for not paying attention, not looking at the screen. Well, that's creepy. We win though. I have to say, these units suck. We must help our lord and saviour, King Pinter. Protect the king! We saved the miserable bugger. Oh, that's much better. Why can't they always be like that? <gasps> He's smiling. The world's on end next week! Can you give me some special treatment because of that? Oh, we sell all those prisoners. Look at that. And we sell all the loot. Easiest way to make money, I'm telling you. Now let's get to another castle. Why is this wall not guarded? Oh, that's a nice catapult you have. Boom, baby. Screw your catapults. This castle is ours. See, that's not bad either. And we're now clan to level three. We all know what that means. More. Oh, wow. We're not going to get given this castle either. Eh, screw it. I'll use my influence to get it. My relation with Caladog will decrease. Ah, it's fine. He hates me anyway. Thank you. Another one. Can't wait to be overlooked on this one too. We have a foothold on the wall. Victory. Eh, not bad. Oh, don't even speak to me. Oh, I don't bloody think so. I feel like I'm getting used at this point. 
See, look at that. They need my numbers to take this army. Oh, my word. How many horses? I hope you're all enjoying the episode, everyone. I'm enjoying this so far. Don't forget to give that like and subscribe button the manliest laugh possible for me. It'll help with the channel and the algorithm. So, thank you so much for that. And if you feel like it, don't forget to leave a cheeky comment. Now, back to the chaos. Ah, I'm just watching the carnage. This is quite satisfying. Yep, and the new damn thing really is let me army do the rest. Okay, never mind. They will crap again. Oh, hello, another siege. I won't mind that. I wonder what happens if I just let them do it on their own and I just stand there. Oh, they won quite quickly anyway. Not bad, not bad. Though. How many times have I been overlooked? Oh, look, they're attacking the castle again. I'd say in terms of the open fields like this is probably where the skirmishes will be at their best. Yes, sir. Oh, so much better. Oh, another siege. Because we haven't had enough of them, have we? How many times have I took this one castle, I swear? And a siege that lasted under five minutes. That was worth it. Oh, wow. Why are you only performing now? Oh, uh, we're making peace with now as well. I'm not surprised. Oh, my. I don't know what I've done to deserve this. Right, everyone. I'm actually going to leave the gameplay there because I'm sick of getting over. Locked. What we're going to do now is take these skirmishes into the custom battles to test them against other units to see how they fare. I'll see you there. Right, everyone, we're going to go straight into it. It's the skirmishes, as you all know. We're against the Buccaleries, is, is that how you say them? I, I can never pronounce them. I'm sorry about that. But that's what they're up against. It's going to be ranged cavalry against cavalry. I think these are just cavalry, aren't they? Not just range. But regardless, Let's see how they get on. They're in charge, so they should do the biz. And in the meantime, I'm just going to take this person out. Wah! I know people in the comments did say, don't take myself out like that. But just for the fact, like, I, you won't be able to see the gameplay properly or the sim properly. And, like, it, it does take too long as well. I'm going to take myself out. So now it's fair, because they've lost their lord as well, don't forget. So here we go. See, we have to do this, otherwise this will take forever. But I tell you what, they're doing well, the skirmishes here. Although, I have to say, the Bookish Shelleys, Larrys, what they're called, I can never pronounce them, someone will definitely tell me I'm saying that wrong. They're not the best unit in the world. They're, they're actually the lowest ranking cavalry unit, whether it's ranged or normal cavalry, they're the lowest ranking ones. So, it doesn't surprise me. And look at that. The skirmishes actually won very comfortably. That was 100 versus 100, and that was so fast, and it's done. Right, number two. Again, it's the skirmishes, this time against the Mameluke Heavy Cavalry, because we used them, and they were terrible. So, let's see how this one gets on. And look at this. Here we go. Boom, baby boom. Who wins this? That is the question. I'm actually... You know what? I'm, I'm going to go for it. I reckon the skirmishes will win this. I really do. I reckon... This, look at them all. <laughs> I reckon the skirmishes will win this. Oh, well, there you go. Jobs are done. They beat them as well. I'm assuming 100 versus 100 because there's a few we need to get through here. But there you go. Again, they won. And I would say it's quite comfortable, to be fair. It was. Right, this is where I think they might actually lose. We're against the next worst unit, which is the Heavy Lancers. And it's just cavalry versus cavalry at this point. But again, I'm... Um, very confident they're going to lose this fight. Well, there you go. And now we just do this. Here we go. Well, it doesn't matter. The Lancers, I've obliterated them, as to be expected. Look at that. Obliterated, as usual. Right, guys. This one's going to be a little bit more different. This time... It says 200 there. It's not 200. This time's going to be more different because I'm quite confident they shouldn't be higher than the Heavy Cavalry. We're going to do it again. Although they beat the Heavy Cavalry, we're going to do it again. But this time, it's not 100 versus 100. It's going to be 1,000 versus 1,000. And unfortunately, this game can't actually do that all at once. So it's like 200 versus 200 at this point. Obviously, more will spawn in. So whoever wins this will be the better unit, in my opinion. And I'm kind of banking on the Heavy Cavalry to win this match. The carnage begins. They already start off really well here, to be fair. But here we go. Now, the fast forwarder begins. Whoa! Look at the lag. What scores it? Ooh, it's actually, it's actually a lot closer than I thought it was. Oh my. Okay, I had to, to get off that fast forward. Now we're back in. Why is there so many trees, though? The trees are ruining it. Oh my word. They, they, they've actually pulled it back. They pull it back. Look. Whoa, this is anyone's game now. Whoa, what's happened here? The skirmishes have dropped. Their standards have weakened. They start out so well, but they've gassed themselves out. They haven't got anything now. Who will win this fight? It comes down to the last hundred. It comes down to the last 100. Here we go. They lost? They lost in the end. What? No way. Wow. That is insanely close. Look at that. Wow. 
Holy, you can't get closer than that. Well, I'm glad we did that, because now I know that they're worse. So we're going to go to the ranking system and rank them. I'll see you there. Right, we are back on our tier list, as you can see. And I actually can't believe it. We've only got this many left to go through. Wow, that's actually gone really fast. You don't want really to care about that. You want to care about where I'm ranking these units right here. And, well, it's really simple for me. I'm, I'm sorry to say this. I don't care the fact that they beat these units here. I'm not putting them in mer tier. I'm putting them in the not worth a tier. I'm sorry, but these units are crap. These units are terrible. They're terrible, honestly. Like they're not. They're not worth it. Let's go says it. They're not worth it. And I'm still not 100 percent sure. Are they actually just mainly cavalry with just a bit of range, or are they actually range cavalry because they have range units? I. I just. I don't know. I don't know. Regardless, they suck at range cavalry and they suck as normal cavalry. These units are terrible. Absolutely terrible. The fact that they lost to these units and these sucked as well shows you that. These units are terrible. I'm sorry. I, I, other people might like those units. Fair enough. But just look at the other cavalry you can use instead. Like, they literally get access to a few javelins, which these don't, which is, yeah, great. But they don't really get kills with them that often. And it comes down to just normal melee kills, which is what cavalry do. And these are just far superior in how they do it. So, like, if you want range cavalry, don't go with these. Go with the car guards. Or even go with the likes of even these two. These two will do the, do a better job than that because they actually do have range. But, but if you want to go for just normal cavalry kills, please don't go for these. Go for these because just, it's just not worth it. They were terrible. Simple as that. Terrible. I got literally a handful of good games with them. That was it. They were awful. It's the fact that, yeah, they have javelins, which is really good, but they only have six. Like, what's the point in that? They, they just won't do anything there. Oh, I can't stress how bad these units are. I really can't. I didn't think I'd actually have a unit in the not worth it area because I thought it would have been either here or that one. But they were awful. But these units alone were enough to make me just want to gouge my eyes out. These just made me just want to headball a wall instead, you know? So let me know if you agree or disagree with my opinion on that. Uh, I'm curious to see what you think. I'm curious to see if, say, if you use them and they do anything for you. Because for me, they didn't do a damn thing. And that concludes this episode, everyone. I really hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed making it. I definitely didn't enjoy these units, though, I'll tell you that. But if you'd be so kind, don't forget to give that like and subscribe button the manliest slap possible for me. It will help with the channel and the algorithm. And I'll greatly appreciate it. And if you feel like it, don't forget to leave a cheeky comment. Do it. Thanks, guys. See you all later.